In Linux, the temp directory, or TMP, is used to store temporary files created by both system processes and applications in Linux-based systems. Examples of temporary files saved to temp are cached data, stored session information, or intermediate processing data. And if you're curious, the temp directory right here isn't anything inherently special in itself, it's just another directory in the file system. What makes it distinct are the conventions and practices associated with its usage. So to check if and when your system is scheduled to clean up the temp directory, use the systemctl list timers command, which I have done right here. And this will list all active timers on your system and show their status, including any related to cleanup tasks. The entries that we are interested in are those containing systemd temp files clean dot timer in the output, which is this one right here. And if you're curious right here, next, this is when the timer is scheduled to trigger next. Left is the time remaining until the next activation. Last is when the timer was last activated. And then past is how much time has passed since the last activation. I can see here that my temp files clean service runs every day around 150. This basically means that this timer is set to activate every 24 hours. And so to dig deeper into the actual cleanup process, we can use the journal CTL to examine the logs for this service. So all I would have to do is just use the command journal CTL and then provide the service, which is our clean temp files. If I run this, we can see all the times it's ran. So specifically this command that I ran, let me exit out of here, this journal CTL command retrieves log entries specifically associated with this service. And it also gives us some nice timestamps for each cleanup event. But now let's actually talk about configuring the behavior for this service. So the actual behavior of the temp directory cleaning service is configurable. And there are a few directories where this configuration is written, though a common one is the location dash user dash lib dash temp files dot D. And specifically, we need to look for the file temp.com. So tmp.com. And if I cat out this, this is all the configuration for the temp files directory. And the syntax used in this file is specifically for systemd temp files and follows a structured format for defining rules on temporary file management. It's straightforward, yet powerful, and allows for granular control over how temporary files and directories are handled. This right here for me is a default configuration and nothing special. But if you want to find out more on the syntax used in this file, you can just run the command man for manual and then tempfiles.d, and it'll list out what everything does in here. I want to thank you for liking and subscribing. Check out my courses and software in the description, and take it easy.